same issues. <laughs> but um, I guess they've been trying to make this work for many years. It's not working. Um, so she, he said he's willing to do anything, change any habit. So if he has a habit. If he's gonna yeah. if he's gonna come out with that, then that is probably an issue for him. Um, change his lifestyle, motherfucker! You should have done this in the first place. You oh, guys no. have been together 50, for twelve years. Where is he fifty two? Right? He's fifty two. I don't know. If oh. you're fifty two years old, 52. are you really trying to change your lifestyle at yeah, that point? No, no, he's stuck Not at that point. And he can get any bitch he wants. Like any girl would be like. I mean, if he hit me up, I'd be like, you oh, know, shit. If he hit me up, I'd be like, Look, hold up, Brad. <laughs> I'll be right there in the DMs, you know. <laughs> I don't know. I feel like with a couple like them, if they can't make it, and I don't know, they're like a power couple. Yeah, almost. but you know, you're also dealing with a lot, probably a lot of temptation. Who knows if he's been faithful? She's probably just de- done with his shit. This has probably been going on for a long That's time. What I'm it's just now making the headlines mm-hmm. with something, you know. Well, crazy. they were really private. They're super yeah. private. You never heard about anything until she filed because well, it's yeah, a public I heard record. I heard that's just because of Brad, though. Brad likes being super private. And then now it's all just kind of yeah. snowfalling from that. Snowballing. Well, I just feel bad for their kids because no kid deserves oh, to be yeah. pulled well, into they, this shit. They adopted like five children. Well, yeah, they have a lot of kids together. And now all of them are going to be thrown into the headlines and thrown into all this stuff. There's going to be paparazzi just circling their yeah. house because of all this bullshit. I don't know. I think she should have maybe approached it a different way, but maybe she's so done that she's just like, fuck you, Brad. I'm going to the coats. Yeah, but I don't know. I, part of me feels that, you know, you guys were saying it's a perfect relationship, but nothing's perfect. It just yeah. depends if they want to work it out and they want to forget or forgive what happened and move on. Like, let's be honest. You've been in a relationship for six years. Mm-hmm. It, I'm you'll halfway never, there. You'll never halfway have a perfect relationship. It's no. just if you want to work on it and figure it out or not. Sometimes I wake up to it next to him and I'm just like, I would kill you if I could. <laughs> I don't know. Well, I'll, I'll tell you, like, An- Angelina, Whoa. she's she's a bad, a bad yeah, bitch, bad right? bad bitch. Like, she dated uh, Billy Bob Thornton and she, yeah, she she's had a, a freak. Didn't she have some, like, a blood yeah. vial on her, like, yeah. ne- in her I necklace and stuff? She, she showed up to uh, one of those awards, like the Emmys or the Golden Globes, and she was going to interview and she's like, oh, we just had sex, you know, in the limousine on the way here. That's my, dude, I'm so d- about bad. that life. Damn. See, that's what you want. Did I tell you I was a savage? Rihanna didn't put that in her song for no reason. <laughs> There's some savage ass bitches out there that don't give a fuck. Because look at her, she's going sucks. for it. Boring sucks. Yeah. Fucking I know, Taylor Swift. I've been there. I think it turns me on though if I find like a bad bitch that's bad, but I don't find out about it until after the fact. Oh. I'm like, oh damn, you're a freak. <laughs> I love myself a bad bitch, man. Hell I, yeah. I can't go back after that. Yeah. Well, I'm saying. Are you seeing them bad bitches getting divorces and saying "fuck you, motherfucker"? Well, there's there's your daily deuce of uh, what the fuck daily moments. Deuce? Your we daily dose. A, we just took a shit. We just yeah. <laughs> we'll be coming back with our random number generator again. So everybody, just keep right. that in mind. We'll get we'll get into that. Also, some uh, important relationship advice for you guys coming up next on Skull and Bones Radio. This is Batman reporting live from San Diego, California, the greatest city on earth. Just want to let you know that while I'm keeping the city safe, I'm listening to Skull and Bones Radio right here in the beautiful city of San Diego. Welcome back to another round of the Skull and Bones Show. Uh, Tastes so good, make you want to slap your mama. Matter of fact, come here, mama. Ah! Right here on Skull and Bones Radio. Welcome back, everybody. Yeah, welcome back to Skull and Bones Radio. Make sure you Ooh check wee. us out on SkullandBonesRadio.com, iHeartRadio, Skull and Bones Radio, <laughs> on Facebook, Facebook <laughs> backslash Skull and Bones Radio. I'm really trying here. I'll, I'll give it to you. It's <laughs> Facebook.com slash Skull and Bones Radio. I'll give it, it to you. Check us out on Facebook, Skull and Bones Radio. How about that? That there was good. Go. Um, <laughs> at Skull and Bones Radio. At Skull, so check us out. Uh, we are Drinking Skull and Bones and Radio. Broadcasting. Yeah, we sound great. It's a beautiful <laughs> thing. You know, speaking of drinking, uh, what time is it, Casey? Ooh, it's random number generator time. We're all so, woo girls now. <laughs> let's do it. So, as everybody knows, uh, we each selected two numbers. Ash has got one and six. Matman One Hundo has got two and seven. Jean has got three and five, and myself, I have four and eight. So we're gonna random generate right now. Let's Ready? do it. Is anybody okay. Number seven. Oh. That's Matt, and we got a drink for Matt. the 
God damn it. The thing. Matt. So it's Matt's number to drink? Matt's number to drink to take a shot. All right. Stand by with just one. Oh. I'll leave the mic on. Hold on. Here we go. Oh. Uh. Oh. <sighs> oh. He's doing a shot of Crown as well. Yeah. Oh. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. I don't think right. Mick would have lasted through this podcast, huh? No. He would no have way. freaked out. Lightweight. <laughs> now, I just met this nigga. He want to fuck my butthole. <laughs> now, if I shit on his penis, he going to feel like an asshole. <laughs> That's my favorite thing that's ever existed in this whole planet. So how does that make sense? Why are we playing that? What okay, does that even mean? so I thought it would be a good correlation to eleven important firsts that happen in every long term relationship. Important first, okay. Yeah, does that make sense? Yeah. yeah, yeah. Like, like when you're in a relationship, the eleven most important things that happen with the first time it happens. Yeah, right? because shitting on his dick. <laughs> <laughs> it's a first step. <laughs> Jean was getting dirty over her. Um, but I have been in a long time. Oh, there we go. Drink. <laughs> Here we go. Drink. For a long time. <gasps> That's so funny. The last time I heard that, I laughed so hard I fell off my dinosaur. Why are you doing it twice in a row, man? Because oh I'm God. hungry. Thirsty. And so all these things have happened to me eventually. All with these. With my relationship. Okay? okay. Okay. So number one, unplanned sex in the middle of the day. Done. Unplanned. Oh, okay. That's, that's a first. My first virginity. That seems pretty normal. <laughs> in the though. middle. Yeah, that's like that's you know, like that's, that's like just an a, easy one. But to that's cross just number off, one. You know? you know, that's just number one. Because you've done this with off. Tinder, right, Matt? I don't know nothing about <laughs> said things. He's calling people out over here. Not during the day, though. I'm not a savage. I wait till the night. You liar. Why, why not? Why not during the middle of the day? Well, here I gotta. I told you guys about my plan. I used to do the Point Loma thing. I've kind of switched it now. I do. Uh, Good. I do a a dog beach. Oh. Session, yeah. So that yep. way he can involve his dog in it. You see? Yes, because he's super cute. Love him. Uh, he's an oh. idiot, though. No, well, yes, he is. But that way, I see if a they like dogs, super important. B if they like me, really important. Three, can they put up with that my bullshit? Not super important. Though. That is the most important. If they can do all three, then they get a night date. That's how it goes. Wow. Number two. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Wait. Fuck you, Matt. Wait. Number two. Dude, all right. Is... Well, I guess that's another drink. Uh, we tried drop. a sex, a new sex position, and it sucked. Virginity. Have you guys ever had a new sex position that you've tried and it sucked? And it sucked. Yeah, missionary. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> I don't know. Like, I would say different places sucked, but not necessarily different positions. Okay, I'm trying to like have you guys visualize this while I'm saying it. I I've done this, this one girl over my desk, and that wasn't that much fun. That sounds like fun. Oh, that sounds like nah, a good time. It wasn't that much fun, to be honest. It's her, it's her it vagina. Because it's a high desk, so oh. she's like up like this. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Gotta lift her up. <laughs> um, one time, AJ and I did like, uh, he stood up and like I was facing him with my private to his face thing. Like 69? Here, right? like a, yeah, like, but I know, but I don't want to say like, I like to call it a vagina. Your coochie. You know? My coochie. That's fine. And like uh, he was standing up, so I'm right here facing towards him. And he's standing, and I like almost died. Wait, okay, hang on, because <laughs> our listeners don't. I don't. I don't. So uh, yeah. he's standing up. Yeah. You're upside down. No, I'm. I'm right side up. So I'm facing like so. It'd be like me and on his shoulders, but my vagina is facing his face. Okay, so yeah, oh, you're yeah. on his shoulders, and he's eating you out. So yeah, he's just rug munching. But he, we fell. <laughs> oh, <laughs> so, that sucked. That was the first. Know. I feel like things like that make for like a stronger relationship as well. Yeah, I was like, wow, you've seen all of me, definitely. That's <laughs> well, for sure. yeah, and those stupid random moments. You yeah, know? like when you're really, 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 really drunk. <laughs> <laughs> really, really, really? <laughs> like super Hold drunk. On, babe, let's get up on my shoulders. Like, babe, like, let me like reverse my shoulder you. Like, I don't even know what to call it. That sounds like fun. It was fun. And the thought process was fun. But Just until to work? I'm five, almost five nine. <laughs> okay, so me falling is like timber, you know. <laughs> there she blows. There she blows. Number three, sex in your childhood bedroom virginity. I've had that. Mm, done I've that. Done that. That has been fun. That's great. No, it wasn't fun for me, man. Like, uh, I had a twin bed, so we're both me trying too. to fit. <laughs> Both trying to fit on the bed. It, it just didn't work out. Yeah, that my well. sister was in the room. This is duh. Wait. I mean, she was a small ass girl, but it. I don't know. Yeah. I think afterward, like trying to sleep on it was just not comfortable. I had a, at all. A, like a trindle. Remember the trindle yeah, beds? The trindle the, beds. Do, 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 do. Yeah. And my sister was in the room. 
And uh, that was awkward. Well, I Wait, know. I want to know how, how, how did Matt's go because he's much taller, I'm sure, now. Well, yeah, dude, I got like a twin bed at home as well. What? <laughs> no, you're you the only don't. kid and your parents give you a twin bed? My parents are just like, you get the twin bed, that's all you, you get, You don't have baby. a twin bed Oh, there. I got a drink. I said, baby. I love that word. There you go. You got me on that, John. But uh, yeah, it was fun. The cool part, well, this was with actually a girlfriend. But she went into the closet and started picking out like my my like clothes from when I was younger. Mm-hmm. She like oh, wore my that. like Boy Scout uniform. What the fuck? It was actually surprisingly arousing. It was great. Ew. Okay, hold on. Uh, did we just say that Matt's into little boys? Uh, yeah. No, no, I was just right. going to say that. No, no I was going to say for. that. <laughs> I was no. like, you got turned on by her being your boy, boy scout my uniform. uniform. <laughs> my <laughs> fucking uniform. Well, I don't know. I could like because you think about no. the girls wearing You're the sailor hats. You're defending him now. I'm trying to think yeah, logically that's true. here. That's true. Okay, it was with John. I was with John. Hold <laughs> up now, <laughs> baby. <laughs> ah, fuck. There you go. I'm gonna burp. All right, so that was what number two, number three, number four is stayed over but didn't have sex virginity. I've never done that. Me and AJ always used to get it in. Maybe yeah, now no, that we live like together, it's different, time. right? That's like a waste of time to yeah, know. Yeah, what the hell? I would never do that. Especially if you're in like a, a newer relationship. There's no way. No that's way. Not happening. But this is long term relationships. Yeah. Advice. yeah. I can see I, that. Yeah, I guess. Well, we, me and AJ okay, live so, together, so, so it's So, based different... off of your opinion, <laughs> when does it become a long term relationship? I would think like three years. Three but then years, you know, really. three years, and then it's like, oh, like this is going. Actually, we're still really in love, and it's I still going like on. A year and a half, Dude, three. Just, I'm gonna go because you have to be comfortable. I can literally like bend over and flash age in my asshole, and it's normal. <laughs> <laughs> like he'll walk by, and I'm like, hey, and he's like, okay, is like this, this a drink is, moment. Like this is happening. My relationship. Shit. Well, that's yeah. A, uh, <laughs> do, do you still feel that same excitement that you felt three, uh, four right, years we ago? Can't, we can't keep setting her up. Yeah. <laughs> yeah no, no, I'm curious. It's because she was saying, you know, that same excitement. I'm curious. Six years later. Do you I do. Feel- He's my best friend. Okay. Number five. <laughs> <laughs> um, choose getting food over having sex. Virginity. I've done that. Yeah. That's totally me right there. Because yeah, you're so tired. <laughs> but we work a lot. All of us work a lot in here. So I can see that. That happens a lot now, yeah, though. Six like, years like, like later. Hey, do you want sex? <sighs> you got to think I'm about it. I'm hungry, though. <laughs> 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 like I've done that. We'd be like butt naked in bed, just like I really am craving ramen right now. <laughs> it's like your your intentions are there, but mm-hmm. yeah, you can't. But commit the to energy it. level, yeah. the food sounds great. All right, um, what number am I on? <laughs> Wait, what? Doesn't it say there what no, number? No, because I think I skipped one. We'll just choose the next one. Just okay. Have to no, throw we're number. number six. Yeah, six. <sighs> Conversation while you pee, virginity. I wait. So you're, I you're, hate doing your significant that. partners in the bathroom while you're peeing. Yeah, in the bathroom. No, I can have I can have them be outside of the bathroom, but I can't talk to people while I'm taking. I'm a taking a dump and AJ's in the yeah. in the bathroom. I feel like if you're taking a pee, it's okay. If you're taking a dump, that's what I could. We did level. this yesterday. Me, I was but shitting. She's, she's in a long term relationship. So this she is gets six a, years, bro. Sh- there's pretty much no secret. There's no that. more like flashing my asshole is pretty intense. I bet right? You, uh, have you ever had a girl just like? <laughs> like, have you ever had a girl do that to you? Morning. Good morning. Love you. <laughs> so, like, yet. me, even like, I would take dumps, and AJ would like, we'll be talking about what we're going to do today. Like, oh, we're going to the beach, and yeah. So, that's that's that. Number seven, ditching a date night for pizza and TV virginity. Oh, uh, hell yeah. I've done that before. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I do that not, all the time. Like, a date night, like having to go out and be yeah, like, like oh, oh, we're going to go to dinner gonna... tonight. You plan it in the morning. Hell yeah, I've done that yeah. before. Yeah, and then you're like, you get home after work, and then you're like, I want to sit and eat pizza and watch that's, movies. That's a girl that you want to be with. Wants to give up the date night for pizza. <laughs> that's and movie. why me and AJ have been together for so long. I've uh, done drink. that for I've done that for other plans, but not for like a date night. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> um, please be my amateur doctor, Virginia. Like, check out this. I have this weird thing on my leg. Or oh, I have. Look, check my arm. I really stink. I feel today. like that happens more often than people think it does. Like, I think that just Matt and Casey friends. probably do that a lot. <laughs> I was just thinking that. Like, not. Dude. We don't really get into trouble that much with like our like. I got bit by this dog like probably a month I'll ago. Just no look way. At it. I'll just, just look like, at it and be like, uh, you're fine, bro. Yeah. I'm drink, like, oh, dude, I can't feel my leg. You bit by a dog? You drink, yeah. by the way. That hey, sucks. I said, bro. Oh, drink. Sorry. Oh. It's over at this girl's house, and this dog, she was dog-sitting. Like, we were all cool, but then I gave him the the bro drink. 
I gave uh, him the like, what's up? I like, a, you know, advanced towards him and he totally bit me. It was hell yeah. I would bite you too. Yeah. Well, look at me. And then, um, uh, number. 